Hello, so I got a request to do an updated version of my 21 question get to know me. The last one I posted was about three years ago and somehow it got switched to private. So I just made it public last night and I will link it down below in case you wanna see that one. I thought it might be a little boring or redundant to do the same exact 21 questions. So I found, um, I Googled questions, get to know me questions. And there's actually like 350 on this list, but I'm only gonna like skip around and do random numbers. Um, I'll say what number they are so that I don't get confused when I'm posting this. Hi everybody. <laughs> number 31, who's your favorite person in the world? <sighs> favorite person, I'm not gonna single out one of my children. So I'm gonna have to say my husband. I love him to death, even though he's a brat. <laughs> <clears throat> Number 32, what is your favorite childhood memory? Favorite childhood memory. I, again, can't really pick out one. I would say I loved going to spend time with my grandma every summer. Hi, stinker <laughs> Um, I'd spend a couple weeks in the summer with my grandma in Washington. Um, and I love doing that. Uh, number 33, what is your favorite color? Uh, black or maybe gray? No. Nope. I'm weird like that, I guess. Number 35, what is your favorite drink? If I had to pick one, I would say coffee. I would say the Annihilator at Dutch Brothers Coffee. Uh, what is your favorite fairy tale? Uh, probably Beauty and the Beast. No, it doesn't narrow it down to Disney, but I love Beauty and the Beast. Number 16, what is one thing that you've never revealed to your parents? <laughs> Honestly, I'm an open book to everybody. Um, for a while, I kept it a secret that I... Yeah, I'm not going to share that. <laughs> but... Um... You don't need to be here with my secrets either, little boy. I have my eight-year-old right here. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm gonna skip that one too because I honestly, there's one thing that I kept for a secret for a few months, but they, I told them, so I don't really have any secrets from them. What do you call your grandparents is number 18. I called my grandma Nanny. She and grandpa were from England. Um, it's always been grandpa and then my dad's mom is grandma. Uh, number 20, what is your biggest accomplishment? I would say my biggest accomplishment was... Just cleaning the house. <laughs> at one point, I broke the world record for breast milk donation. Um, I do have videos about that from a long time ago. Good mama. But um, that was probably my biggest accomplishment. And since then... The record's way been shattered, like, several times, but. Uh, number 21, what is your biggest fear? Something happening to my husband or something happening to me and my children not having both parents. Uh, 22, what is your biggest regret? My biggest regret is going to Everest Institute for medical assisting because I am more in debt now than I was the day I signed up, like 11 years ago. <laughs> and I was never able to use that medical assisting diploma. Um, what is your eye color? My eyes are brown. <laughs> Mine too. Yep, just like my oldest. Oh. Number 26, what has required the most courage of you in your life so far? The most courage. Boy, that's a tough one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Raising kids. <laughs> Um, honestly, it takes a lot of courage to speak up against teachers and doctors and get the help your children need because you know your children the best and having to go around teachers and doctors, um, takes a lot of courage. I would say maybe that. That's what comes to mind. I didn't read these questions before, so I haven't had a lot of time to think about it. What is your favorite actor? Me. Oh boy, guess The Rock, maybe, or Vin Diesel, I don't know. Who is your favorite actress? Julia Roberts or Sandra Bullock were my favorites. I don't really watch a lot of TV. Uh, number 29, who is your favorite celebrity? Isn't that the same thing? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna answer that one. Number 30, who is your favorite musician? 
I would have to say Chris Young after seeing him in concerts in like September, August or September. I've been like obsessed with his music. <laughs> Number 37, what is your favorite food? But I would say it's sauerkraut and linguisa pizza with the garlic sauce and onion and tomato. It's delicious. No, I will make a how-to video on that one of these days because it sounds weird, but it's amazing. Number 38, what is your favorite holiday destination? Um, uh -huh. We don't really go anywhere. When my grandparents were here, I would always go to my nanny's for Christmas Eve. I never missed a Christmas Eve at nanny's. Um, but since she's gone, I would say the hall, which is my husband's side of the family, um, Christmas Day activity get together that they do. Um, number 40, what is your favorite music genre? Um, I would have to say country, I think. I like rap and hip hop too, but I would say I'm an alternative too, but I think country is probably my favorite. Number 41, what is your favorite physical activity? I would say hiking. Um, in my teen years, before I got my license, it was definitely biking, but since then, I went a long time with not enjoying any kind of physical activity, but um, I would say hiking, definitely. Number 42, what is your favorite quote? This too shall pass is my favorite quote. I say it to myself probably 100 times a week. Number 43, what is your favorite snack? I love vegetables and ranch, like cauliflower, carrots, celery, and ranch. I love it. Number 96, do you have any allergies? I do not have any allergies. Um, I notice that if I eat a lot of bread, then I get really puffy. Same thing with beer. If I have any beer, my face, my hands, well, kind of like they are right now because it's first thing in the morning. And yeah, it's snowing right now. <laughs> we don't get a lot of snow here. Um, number 98, do you have any pets? I have two dogs right now. I have a German short hair pointer named Max and a bloodhound named Lucy. Um, we had a bearded dragon who sadly passed away about a month ago. He had a respiratory infection that we thought was better and it turned out it wasn't. So rest in peace, Morty. Number 100, do you carry a donor card? I do not. Um, at one point, I believe when I got my license renewed, I signed up to be a donor, but I don't have an actual donor card. Uh, number 101, do you have a best friend? If so, who? I have two best friends and I love them equally. I love them to death. They're totally different people and I don't know. I feel like I can be myself with both of them. Uh, one is Alexandra, the other is Amanda been friends since middle school with Amanda and high school since Alexandra. Number 102, do you believe in ignorance is bliss? Why or why not? I do. <laughs> um, having ADHD, I can only focus on the things that interest me and things like politics don't interest me. And I feel like if I knew more, I would be more upset all the time. Um, so I choose to be ignorant about certain things. Number 103, do you believe in love at first sight? I do not. I believe in lust at first sight, but not love. Number 104, who performs the most random acts of kindness out of everyone you know? Um, I would have to say my six-year-old. He's my monster, but he can be <laughs> very loving, very caring. He really can surprise you. Um, number 105, who was your last text message from? Um, my sister last night telling me to update <laughs> or uh, add a description to my 21 random facts about me, get to know me questions. Uh, number 106, who was the last person you ate dinner with? Last night I ate dinner with my six-year-old and my three-year-old because my eight-year-old and my husband were wrapping, wrapping elk, meat. Wrapping elk, elk meat. meat. What is your idea of special time together? Um, 
I don't relax a whole lot, so I guess special time together would be relaxing with my family. Maybe watching a movie that we can all enjoy. Uh, 112, what is your most embarrassing moment? <laughs> I have no idea. Brat, what is my most embarrassing moment? <laughs> Yeah, okay. <laughs> so if we're related, don't watch this. Um, but I would say <laughs> when my husband and I went out on a drive, we were on a back road <laughs> and a cop pulled up when we were having fun outside the car. <laughs> okay, number 114. What, you say? what is your star sign? I am a Cancer. And I fit the T very well. What is your ideal first date? My ideal first date. Um, not taking your sister along. <laughs> first date with my husband. My sister was there. <laughs> but she was visiting from out of town and I hadn't seen her in a long time. But um, I would say my ideal first date might be, I don't know. Like if your first, first time meeting the person, I would say maybe dinner and a movie, but if you kind of know the person already, um, I'd say a drive out in the woods to go shooting during the daytime, or um, maybe a fire pit. I don't know, somewhere you can talk and get to know each other better. <clears throat> Number 17, what is the top of your bucket list? I would say, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe taking the RV and traveling to Estes Park. I've been there one time and I think my family would love it. And I would love to travel with the RV. Number 19, what is the name of your first pet? My first pet I would consider to be Bubbers. His name was Rascal. He bit the neighbor kid. Had to go live with my grandparents for a year. He came back and he was Bubbers. <laughs> um, so most of his life, he was Bubbers. Number 20, 120, what scares you about aging? What scares me the most is pain and suffering, I think. <laughs> Not being able to keep up with my kids. Um, I would love to be an active old person who can keep up with my grandkids someday, but I have a lot of pain and discomfort and I'm only in my mid thirties. So number 122, what is, or how difficult is it for you to forgive someone who refuses to apologize? I give in a lot, probably a lot more than I should. Um, 45, what is your favorite sport? I don't really watch a lot of sports. If I had to pick one that I watch, I would say football, go Ducks, go Seahawks. But as far as playing goes, I don't even know. Mama doesn't play sports. I did track and field in high school and I did basketball. Oh yeah, mommy rides bikes too. <laughs> okay, number 46, what is your favorite time of day? I would say first thing in the morning. I don't know why. <laughs> Most of the time it's first thing in the morning. Rarely I'll have a hard time getting up, but I just want to have the most energy and when I wake up, when I get to spend time with my kiddos or school, number 47, what is your favorite type of clothing? Uh, I would say shorts and a tank top just cause that's comfy and I'm always hot. It seems like, yep. <laughs> um, I'm only going to do a couple more. Number 49, what is your favorite restaurant? Um, I would say the old Markham Inn before it burned down. It's pretty good. Markham burgers are delicious, but I haven't been since they rebuilt it and I've heard they're not as good. Um, now I would say Buffalo Wild Wings Buffalo. because that's where hubby and I go. It's within walking distance. We could walk home if we had a little bit too much to drink. Um, and last one. Number 52, what is your favorite social media channel? I would say Facebook, I'm on it all the time. And yeah, I've learned a lot from Facebook. So hope you enjoyed this. Bye guys, I'm Mama.